to a dang thing. All right, we talk. Well, I'm Ranger Cookie, and we'll try a magnifying glass with chalk cloth with a little uh, fuzzy stuff and a bird's nest. We'll see if it works. That should be it. It should be instant. There it is. Now blow away. It's lit. You don't even need that no more. It's so thick. There you go. No, you got it. You got it. Just keep on blowing. There you go. Let me do it one more time. One more. Yeah, your charcoal's lit. lit. Now you just blow, blow, blow. There we go. There we go. Ah. That simple. Oh, it shows up good in the uh, shade. <laughs> now let that be a lesson to you. Char cloth. Very, very vital. Magnifying glass or char cloth works. We tried leaves. We tried pine needles. We tried every other... Dingity dang, we tried paper, we tried a uh, cotton ball with a black dot on it, it didn't work. But the char cloth worked the best. Safety first. Safety first. <laughs> worked, the, worked the best with the magnifying glass. So, I do believe the char cloth is a good candidate for the magnifying glass. Alright, I'm Ranger Cookie, I hope you enjoy our video. <laughs> All right. I mean, we're recording, yes. Let's take a look at the finished product. I see it's still burning over here. Oh, it's catching on fire. Oh, no. It's actually on fire? Yeah. I, I put it out. Cool. Oh, the stick's on fire. <laughs> <laughs> I can all right, all right, all right. Don't, I can see it smoldering. It's, it's the char cloth is working. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we're going to uh, put it back inside the tin. Oh, it needs the top, more. And that will smother it out. And it's like there's an yeah. ember right there. Yeah. <laughs> that is wild. <laughs> that is wild. <laughs> Never had that happen before. Stop. Stop. All right. We just took it out the fire. We're going to do a uh, yeah, look see, see what's going on in this box. I'll try to crack it like an egg. Ooh, looking good so far. Sneak peek. Let's see her. Ah, come on. Sneak peek. <laughs> It was a How cook. long would you say that was cooking? Oh, sh well, at least 10, 10 minutes, 20. maybe. 10 minutes, maybe. Yeah. I mean, once we got the fire going good. Yeah. Uh, close it back up. There we go. Oh. That looks some good charcoal. Yeah, that's good stuff. See how well that holds together? Thick blue jean material. Now, I'm curious about the inside. Get a smaller stick. Unravel. Okay. Yes, okay. Nope. It's still hot. No, I can handle okay. some heat. No, it I looks I like it's actually done all hey, the way. We're blurry. Why are we blurry? Uh, Stop. Is it really him? Is it my hero? Where's your cape at, you bastard? That's right. 
right here. <laughs> it's me, it's me, it's Manland, guaranteed. You yeah, sure? Yes, in full, out of sync color. Are you sure you're sure you wasn't sure at the time you're sure? I'm not so sure you were sure. Well, if you're not down with that, I got a suggestion for you. Watch this video in black and white. <laughs> All right. I've been feeding this fire. Keeping it hot. And I guess I keep doing it for about 10 minutes or so. Make sure everything's inside the box is burnt or charcoaled. And later on, you can use the charcoal to make fire. All right, I'm Ranger Cookie, and this is my first attempt to make chalk cloth. I did see videos how to make the stuff, but this is my first attempt with a helping land of man land. All right, um, here goes. So basically, you're supposed to just take your all toys with your material in, place it on the fire, and let it cook, hoping the can don't explode in your face. The gases and all the good stuff that's inside of the can. And we'll keep feeding the fire until it burns. It's open. At one point, I'm not saying you, you stop. One point. Yeah. Are you on? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Hello, once again. It's me. It's me. It's me. Uh, we're going to use the Altoids can to make the char cloth. Everyone's seen this before. Now I want to state this very, very... You do not have to poke a hole in the top of your can. The can's got plenty of air vents around it everywhere. But what we're about to see, and I'm going to make sure this don't go out because it's going out. That you have to tend to quite a bit to keep the fire going. But Ranger asked me a very important question. I've never packed my Altoids tin that full before blue jean material I'm very curious to see how this works I think it's gonna work fine but we're about to find out if you're running I have to make a confession we use the lighter to start the fire so we can make char cloth so we can make a fire <laughs> that's it <laughs> basically so I think I'm fixing to <laughs> I just took it off so you can oh, talk about it. You know what? Now the wind's starting to blow. That way, that this that way. That direction. We could do it from the top too. That would actually cause a draw. But that's not that bad. Well, I'm Ranger Kuki, and this is my first attempt. Well, with a hand of land, man. Show me how to make char cloth. Yes, right now we've created, we've created smoke. Remember, I'm an expert in these situations. I, I know how to you. make. I know how to. <laughs> Gonna try this with the straw only, fine straw wrapped inside the larger with the magnifying glass and got to find the sun there she goes and you kind of roll it around roll it around just a little bit nope not enough the target has to be flat as possible. I'm trying to blow from way back here. <laughs> Gotta change hands. Almost gonna work. There she goes. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> Not good. <coughs> 
It's gonna work because it's already on fire. <laughs> I'm on fire. <laughs> do not, do not suck in the smoke. Do not suck in the smoke when you're that close with a magnifying glass. <laughs> you can't see if it's on fire. Oh, let's get up here a second. Let me say this right quick. I'm thinking about it. When you use a magnifying glass, it is so bright what you're looking at, it actually does burn the retina. You can't focus, you can't see. You got this blinding white bright light. But it does work. Until next time, don't do what I do. I'm an idiot. <laughs>